Hey guys, it's Becky. If you're new here, then welcome. And if you're already subscribed, thanks for coming back. <clears throat> I nearly forgot my intro then. <laughs> um, I'm starting another haul today, another haul haul. So this is from Lily Blossom Designs. And if you use my code WHOOPS30, you get 30% off. Look, look. I literally did a spread in my um, cousin uh, on the daily pages using this and some washi tape. I want all those washi tapes though. So that's my free sampler. I ordered some dates in foil. I really like her um, her foiled date dots because they're on clear paper and it they're, they're just really, really good quality. Really good quality. Uh, so I got a silver, a rose gold and a gold. You can see the difference in the golds there. And I also got this pink because I thought... I really liked it. I like that pink. And then I bought a standard kit called Sage. I just couldn't. I just couldn't pass it up. Look at this. This is this is absolutely stunning. So we've got eight full boxes there. I do love an eight full boxes. And then you get an extra box there with nine. And then you've got Monday through Wednesday and Thursday through Sunday. This is standard, isn't it? Let me just double check. Let me double check. Um, yeah, standard, one and a half. I don't know why we've got short washi and long washi on a standard, though. On a standard. Yeah, that's right, isn't it? Yeah. I'm losing my mind. I'm thinking of, um, I'm thinking of, uh, stalages and how they're all the same page. But, yeah, this is normal for a standard. Um, yeah, Monday through Sunday, I just love it. I love the washi as well. Both pieces. Absolutely stunning. And then, oh, we get another full box that I really like that. Another full box, loads of functionals. Oh, this is really, really good kit. Loads of headers and glitter headers. This week habit, next week meals, workouts, goals, work to do, school, reading, highlights and, and clean. More functionals and more fun You could easily do two spreads out of this. Eight, nine, ten full boxes. Just use five each on a spread. And then you've got all of the rest of it to play with. So I am really, really happy with that. And I love the Little artwork. cheeky thing to unbox. I've been so excited for this. I haven't opened it or looked or anything. Because it's just come. So I'm just going to pull it out. So I've decided the last six months of the year. I'm going to be trying out as many planners as I can. I'm so excited about this. This is from Paper Test Designs. She does a multitude of different planners, but she's just bought out. Oh, it's got my dress on. She's just bought out TN. Casey's asked me to start saving these little bits in a bag so that she can use them for her friend's presents. She's just bought out TN sized notebooks. Now she's got a monthly, she's got a blank journal, she's got a uh, let me let me um let me, let me have a look. So she has got a B6 yearly notebook, uh, a weekly notebook which is the same um like in size as this but it's sized the same as the weeks. And then she's got the, the TN Yearly Planner, which is undated. And then she's got the TN Booklets, which is what these are. Um, there's half a year in each book. That's why I bought two. But she does, like, the standard uh, weekly, which is this. She does a blank journal, which is 200 pages. She does a monthly, which is um, undated. Monthly book booklet undated. Uh, she does a doc grid notebook. And she does a... A vertical weekly and a horizontal weekly but I just wanted to try out um, the uh, layout of this I'm so excited about this uh, someone's very very kindly sending me a a week because it was the weeks that I wanted to try obviously this is going to be a lot bigger someone has um, offered to send me her weeks that she's not using but it's the same um it's the same kind of layout i love the stitching on the sides i love the embossment the weekly planner undated edition and that's in rose gold and yeah let's just get in here so it is Tomo river paper um these are second quality it's their first release i don't know why they're second quality i think maybe them they're, they're printed like 
like a misalignment or something I don't know they look pretty good to me they do lie flat you get a just a blank grid space there the grid sizing on the uh, weekly one which is the one that I've got here is where's the grid size is four by four millimeters so what I did what I did before and this might be interest to some of you it might not but I wrote down all the grid sizes of all the planners if you want to like print screen this because I thought that it was like going to be really easy to to see the difference so the TN standard you can see has got a bigger grid than the Hobonichi A5 but the weekly one is 4 by 3.9 so only only a little bit of difference really between this one and the and her version of the weeks so you get a nice big double spread here you've got a double line at the top and then you've got a thicker line at the bottom I do like that and then look at this layout guys look at it it's quite light so I will bring it up so on the left hand side you have this box here trackers quotes washi uh, stickers like little like you name it you're like you can fill that and then you've got the same as like the Hobonichi Weeks in the sense in her weeks planner this line does carry on across but I like the fact that that's blank so you've got your Monday through Sunday on the left hand side which you can obviously fill in for your reoccurring tasks or appointments or anything like that you could use this as a long to-do list or a long shopping list or anything like that or you could carry on the line and you could use it like how I do in my weeks. So I put like I rate my day there and then I do a little blurb on how my day's gone. Um, you could do that in here loads. And then you get this, which I've just fell in love with. I haven't seen many videos of different ways of people using this. So that's the reason why I wanted to buy this. I just want to try it out. I want to try and see, you know, if this, if I could replace my weeks with this. Um, if it's good as like a functional planner like anything like that and then you've got some um lines there and then one two three four five six seven eight nine so you've got nine little bullet points there nine bullet points there and then you've got the top box where you can write in like i don't know to do's and or work and home or personal or whatever and then here you've got one two three four one two three four five six seven eight nine so you could easily do like meal planning and stuff and tracking in there and then you've got this section at the bottom here and the paper the paper feels gorgeous it feels like tom river paper i would say it feels like thicker than the hobonichi one um does it say the um 68 gsm top over paper so it's 110 millimeters by 220 millimeters so 11 centimeters by 21 uh, the grid size is 4.4 the paper is 80 gsm the cover is 200 gsm high quality cardstock and it does feel like that uh, it's undated um it's sewn so you know you will be able to manipulate it it will lie flat like i always like the fact that i can like fold my books over and they'll be fine yeah it, it's proper sewn in there it's not coming away at all um there's 64 pages i'm not sure if at the end if we get any blanks let's go right to the end where you could add in some like extra trackers so you get you get one two three four five six seven eight yeah nine nine like pages of um nine sheets at the back and yeah I, i'm just so excited to use this i'm really really i recently sold my passport tn but i really want to give tn in a go but i'm not sure i'm not sure so that's why i bought these so i'm gonna just use one to just like play around in and, and do some kind of spreads and stuff and see what i like and then yeah i'll just take you along on this little tn journal with me um and i have got some other planners coming in as well because like my three planner system i have said it does work um like the weeks the cousin and the a6 algae are all working for me nothing needs to change apart from the fact that i'm not forward planning that's why i bought in the functional home in each cousin but i don't know why i don't learn but i have um ordered um some other planners 
I can't remember what I've ordered now, but I have ordered some other plans as well. So yeah, that's it for this little bit of the haul and I'll see you in a minute when I've got something else. I've got another order from Graceful Muse Papery. I just, I can't stop guys, I can't stop. And like, for me, if you use my, I've got two codes down below. Uh, one, um, oh, two different bags, what's going on? Oh, let's try and get all this out how it was. Um, yeah, the first code is a referral code, so you get 20% uh, off, I think, if you use that code, but you can only use that code once. And every time you use that code, I get like five Canadian dollars, um, and loads of you have been using the code. So I I went on and I was like, oh, I want to use all my dollars. Um, so I made another order. And the second code that I've got down there is for 15% off, and that's if you're already a subscriber. So if you're already a subscriber, um, to her then you get 15% off but if you're brand new jump on it because you get the 20% off on the referral code which gives me five Canadian dollars to spend which means oh dropping stuff I can show you more goodies so first off this is the card like wildflowers you must allow yourself to grow in all the places people thought you never would I really like that it's like a broken light bulb but with a flower coming out so yeah, that I, oh, that's really cool. So you never thought you could grow anything out of a light bulb. I really like that. I really like that. Don't use thank you 15, just use my code. Oh, that's really cute. And then it's a little, I think you get this with all your orders because I got it with the last one, if you remember. So this is the freebie you get and everyone loves this freebie. So I know people have asked her to, bought her in, to, to put it in the $3 spot so they can buy it. Don't blame them. So Becky15 gets 15% off. And then, yeah, it's the same. So you get these three. And I think they'll change depending on the season. But just look at that. Right, that that's a spread in itself. That's a spread in itself. Especially with, like, the smaller planners. So, like, your Hobonichi Weeks... Um, your nostalgias, like all small planners, weekly size planners, or passport or anything small, easily get a couple of days worth out of that. That is gorgeous. And I think that's what you get as the freebie. So yeah, make sure you jump on that. So I wanted to try out her tabs. So I got the planner tabs A. I just got them in clear. They're just they're on quite a thick sticker paper, which is nice, and it feels sturdy, so it doesn't feel like they'll break. And I got the A, because I think that's the font type there, so some little tabs. And then, right, let's see, I got the whole sheet which is on there of these Deco Girls, because I'm obsessed. I'm literally obsessed. I just, I think she's stunning. And it just goes to show that plus size women can look bloody gorgeous. I need that outfit. I need to find something that's like that because I just absolutely love that. Right, the way her kits work, which I like, is let me just go on to the website because I just want to get this 100% correct. So the Home and Each Cousin weekly kits, which is one I'm going to show you, you go on there and you can select the options. So you can get the weekly essentials sheet. So let me get my Home and Each Cousin kit ready so you can get the weekly essentials sheet which is this one so you can buy them all a la carte so this has got your bottom washi your monday through sunday a monday through sunday one box you know if you just wanted one sheet then you can buy it as an individual sheet so that's sheet a and then sheet b is the full boxes which is here so you get a full box on your sheet A and then you get four on sheet B. So that's um, five full boxes. And then you can get functional boxes, which I didn't get, um, which is just like um, just like uh, square boxes. And then you get sheet D, which is this one, which is classed as the journaling deco. So I just get sheet A, sheet B and sheet D. And, yeah, I just think, I mean, look at these. Look at the washi. Look at that. And I got this as well because it's like, 
because I think of that as a classroom and it's got like the books and first day of as in school and you've got lockers and you've got a little ruler so I thought this would be perfect for when I restart my uni course or I've got the books still from last year not last year the year before when I deferred so I am wanting to start studying soon and I just thought this kit is it's more of a like delicate kit for like back to school if you know what I mean and I also picked up along with that the journaling kit so this is the Hobonichi um, cousin kit and I picked up the journaling kit as well which you can buy as individual sheets or you can buy them like whole so I just thought I just love all of these it's like a real classic way of saying going back to school I love I'm in love lately I've been on from quite a different few shops and I've bought st stickers that have just got this down because I just think it makes just one bit one line bit down the side of the Hobonichi Weeks or something and a tiny bit of deco just makes all the difference in a spread so you can really you can make these journaling sheets last especially if you're in a smaller planner like this is a six size so if it's a six size we've got two and then you've got these little ones as well which you could put up in the corner or something and then you've got corner pieces you have got monday through sunday and you've got this week two to do's you've got these little uh flags boxes circles that i love the artwork on this is it just me or is this just beautiful absolutely beautiful what was that what's that one called academy she's got an academy collection so yeah this is the academy journaling and deco and then we've got boxes a b and um i can't find it but yeah academy love it it's showing up quite true to color as well on the camera so i absolutely love that and then also i've got what's this this is the uh, wildflowers i believe let me just check my thing this is, yeah the wildflowers journaling kit i mean guys look at that look at that what i want to do is get a bit of tracing paper or a white bit of paper and practice drawing something like that because that is stunning like that really is gorgeous i think i'm going to do a hoping each cousin spread with this and just have that going up the up the sidebar yeah i think that would look stunning oh my god i love the black and white and all these little boxes as well in a spread chef's kiss are these these are the circles squares and lines sorry circle squares and lines as well oh, i just love that and then is that one whole one yeah this one here is one whole one and that one there is one whole one so you could probably do a cousin spread and a week spread using this kit love that love the journaling kits how much are the journaling kits let's just have a quick quick look for you so where are we where are we where are we um journaling kit sorry um so it's just a two-page journaling kit and yeah she a and b six pound six pound lovely right next i have got time traveler standard kit as well and i added on the glitter headers so this is foiled in rose gold foil i don't know i'm just i've never been a foil person but i'm leaning towards foil lately do you know what it is i've been watching a lot of um videos of uh loads of um the american videos of people that shop from sadie's stickers and all that and the foil god it's gorgeous so we've got three six nine four boxes here and some functionals and then we've got all of these functionals and some little headers down there. I've just used this same kit format in my strategy for this week. Look at the washi. I'm not going to want to cut that down. If I do, it's going to be keeping the top. The only struggle I'm having with these is matching washi to them that I've got. But that, that's third world problems. And then I bought the glitter headers as well to go with it. Because you don't necessarily have to use them for just the one kit. You can use them for more than one kit. So that is absolutely stunning. Happy mail from Stationery Pal. 
let's get in here. I think it's mainly pens. I think it's all pens. I think I went on a pen fest. Oh, careful, Becky. Careful, careful. Oh, a nice little thank you there. Oh, what's this? What's oh, a little tiger? Isn't that cute? Uh, thank you. Uh, thank you card and a little squishy tiger and sunshine deal there. And then let's just open these up, shall we? Uh, I don't think this is this pens. Yeah, pens. I didn't order those pens. Did I order those pens? We will soon find out what's in here. Come on, come on. Open, open. Oh, we can see some goodies. So, 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 so. I got some pens, guys. Look at how cute these are. How stinking adorable are they? I got the Uniball, the Uniball one in like the coffee colour and the really, really light pink. And then I got this Muji 0.5 clicker pen. And then I got like a, a Muji pencil. Oh, we're going to have to try these out, aren't we? And I don't remember getting these. They're called study things. Yeah, I'm on more. Look for a for a free pen. I know Casey is obsessed with um, Japanese stationery. So these are actually quite cool. They've got like this uh, one's got like books and everything on it. Right. So let's let's have a little cheeky pen test in the back of the Hobonichi, shall we? Yeah, you can have a look at my con my phone contracts there if you're interested. I need to make sure I'm not showing that page. Did I have I done a pen test in here? Obvs not. Let's do it on this page. Love that packaging. Love it. So let's let's have a look. Let's have a look at this. I don't know what it is. So it's a Muji, it's a Muji, and it's a compact pen. I don't know what, um, it's a 0 0.5, so let's just go into this page. In fact, if I go on that page, yeah, I'm fine. So this is, oh, oh, it undid itself. So this is a, oh, okay, 0 0.5 compact pen it's pink it's pink so this one it's going to be black isn't it Muji it doesn't feel the same as an Enagel cleaner which is also a 0 0.5 right let's try this one this one is the Uniball One. Uniball One, like mini, and coffee. This feels like a cleaner. I love this. I love this. I wonder how long it takes to dry. That was quite quick, so that one. Right, let's have a look at the the old. I'll probably end up giving this to Casey. And this is the Muji 0 0.5 Click. Oh, are these the colours of them? <laughs> I don't I don't know where that went 
But I went to pull out, pull off the nib, and the whole fucking thing exploded. Not trusting these. Exploding pens. I'm covered in crap now. Two seconds. I've cleaned, <laughs> I've cleaned that off. I might let um, Casey have the exploding pens. I reckon she'll like a couple of them. Uh, yeah, won't be using those. Um, I didn't realise that these were the colours of the pen, if that makes sense. So Chris cannot steal that. I will not allow him. These, like literally... How are you? I think they're a little bit thicker and a little bit wetter. Ban the cleaner. Can you see? Isn't it funny how a pen can be thicker? Like, neither of them are amazing at drying. Like, you do have to give them time. Wow, that does dry quicker. And then my pencil. Where's my pencil? Let's have a little look at my pencil. Oh, it's got a rubber on top as well. That's cool. Chris loves himself. Loves himself a mechanical pencil. Should have picked one up for him, really, but I didn't. Look, there's the, the spring from that thing. So... Um, yeah, that's my little order from the station with my pal. And then I've just got a couple more things to show you. That's quite funny, that, isn't it? They're obviously giving away exploding pens on purpose. Don't buy the study pens. Right, here we go, here we go. Ta-da! I bought another pencil case. And I think I'm going to have to buy another one after this because <laughs> this is still really light and it's going to pick up. Like, literally... Guys, I'm obsessed with it. I'm literally obsessed. Obsessed, obsessed. It sits next to me on a shelf that is clean. And look at the state of it. Look at the actual state of it. Coffee pens. Love, love, love these coffee pens. Um, yeah. It, so I was like, right, I need to get one that isn't going to be absolutely disgusting. So I went for the grey, and now the grey's turned up, and I really like it, but it's still really light, so I don't know whether to keep it in its bag. Woo! Keep it in its little plastic bag. That it, sorry. Do you know what, guys? I, I need to sort my shit out. I need to sort my desk out, and I'm thinking that I'm going to do it with you, because, like, why not? Why not show you the shit show of my desk and drawers and I got rid of my trolley, you know them trolleys that like everyone had, those planning trolleys. I got rid of that because it wasn't really like matching with my living room vibes so I got rid of that. But since I've got rid of that, boy do I know I've got rid of that. So that was AliExpress. More things I got off AliExpress are these washi tapes. These are my favourite. You see that me use them all the time in my plan with me's. I stocked up. I think they were like one pound something each. There's shops that sell these for like a fiver. Like if, honestly, guys, if you're gonna buy stuff from shops like washi tape or like folders or anything like that, hold on your water. Have a look, do a favour, do yourself a favour and have a look on AliExpress. This one is the pink with the hollow foil, but these, obsessed with these. It's quite funny because you can blatantly see, like that one, you've got way more than, than, than these. And that one's actually really quite thin. That one's quite thick there. So in order of thickness, I think it goes that one, that one, and that one. But these go with so many uh, Plan With Me's as neutral colours, so obsessed with them. And then two more things that I picked up from AliExpress are nails. So this is where I get my nails from when I don't do them myself. I get them from AliExpress because they're like a pound. And I was like really pissed off at this one woman. She was selling these ones that I'm wearing now on Etsy for like 20 something pounds when you can get them 
um, off AliExpress a lot cheaper. I think these ones are going to be my next ones because I'm just obsessed with that. I need to get some like bright pinks. Um, I have added a few to my basket. I just need to ship them because I love neutral. I am a neutral girl when it comes to my nails, but I'm also an out there girl. So if I can find a design that's like amazing for summer, I mean, look at that. It's just sparkle, sparkle. Get yourself some uh, decent glue. Don't use the glue that comes with them. I use this glue from Ali from AliExpress from Amazon. That's what it's called. Super strong, and yeah, I don't. I mean, some pop off, pop off sometimes, but most times they don't. So yeah, that is uh, the next bit of my little haul, and uh, I'll see you in a minute with some okay, more. Okay, guys, last little one, and then I'm going to end this haul. I have already had this out of its packaging. Look what I did. Look what I did. So this, look at this box. It's stunning, isn't it? This, for those of you that don't know, why didn't I just use that, is the Take a Note Planner. I think that says freedom. The most kind of freedom is to be what you really are. Oh, when you get this. A little calendar thing and then a thank you so that's really weird because all that's in English but I actually had to buy the I think it's the Tai Taiwan version so this is in like a, a purple a purple shimmer <clears throat> I don't know what's wrong with me guys I don't know why I keep buying these planners I mean I've already showed you this one I believe I think that's already been shown uh, this planner guys is stunning so it's an a5 yearly planning i love that they've left this open and like, you can see all the little the little chapters and that is what makes a book lie flat and that is what makes a book be able to do that and hold its spine so absolutely stunning so for those of you that don't know it's quite a simple book i love 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 this green i'm gonna have so much fun setting this up so much fun so you get this page which is stuck on to that page you get a yearly overview um this is where the taiwan comes in because as you can see the day the covers are the i these little icons are the le days of the week so it's it's there you can see it there you can also see it here so unless i make my own sheets i don't think anyone else does um covers for these like if they do let me know it's looking quite light on camera but it's actually it's got this really gorgeous brown and a really gorgeous gray that alternate and then you've just got this as a habit track as a habit tracker you haven't got um give me give me give me a planner give me something planner available anywhere let's grab this one <laughs> I've got like a million planners and I can't find one. So normally, you know, in your planners, you get in your first page, aren't you? Which is like your introductory page. And then you'll get a yearly overview. And then you'll get something like this before you go into the monthlies. Or if you're in a Wonderland 222, you get in like loads and loads of like, um, or a Sterling Inc as well. She does like goals and and all of those kind of trackers so like a wonderland 222 starts out with an index after your index you've got your four years and then you've got this type of overview which is the whole year and then it gets broken down into quarters of the whole year and then after each quarter you get like a routine tracker for each month so it's like, and then after all that, then you go into the monthlies. So yeah, it's completely, this is really simplified down. I don't know what two things would be the things that I would track in here. Um, because it's quite small, isn't it? And then literally, oh, we do have one of these. I apologise. We do have one of these pages. It's a lot smaller than the other, than the other ones. And then you have got a large section down below here for notes, pictures, like, um, you could do quite a few habits in here so you've got the 12 months of that and then you go into the monthlies the monthlies I was a bit like wow that's different so the monthlies are only small 
it's only a small monthly and then you've got this space this space you've got all of that and along the top and again if i compare this to i'll just compare it to the sterling ink because i've got a sterling ink right next to me so this is a b6 and i think yeah it's about the same size as a b6 calendar but even the boxes are smaller than a b6 box so if i put that along the if I line them up, you can see, are they smaller? I think they are a little bit smaller than that and they're a lot smaller than the um, Hobonichi Cousin. But again, you've got the gorgeous grey across the top and then you've got the weekend. These are in English as well as they've got the little icon next to them. These are, if you can see, they are. They have got lines but you can completely ignore those lines so that really really interests me and again the same as a lot of planners you've got all of these months up front and then you've got january february march of the new year and this is where the party starts guys so this you have i'll hold it up because i think it's really light so you have like this is the um this is going from december to January in this week so to start off with you've got your little calendar here with the week highlighted which is the same in a lot of planners you've got a weekly overview here so this side of the page this little section because it's split in two is a weekly overview which I think is brilliant because you can just you've got a weekly overview of your reoccurring tasks then you go into your days so you have your day at the, at the top and then you have one two three four five boxes before the 6 it starts at 6 a.m and it goes through to 3 a.m which you could carry on so and it is 24 hour clock but it's only like it's 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 a really small not small so you get in 63 millimeters so six point let me six point yeah six point three centimeters if you're doing it in inches i'm really not good with inches oh so it's bang on two and a half inches so you're getting two and a half inches there and then you've got the little uh, numbers there and then you've got two and a half inches to write on there so you could do a mock-up on just a piece of a5 paper and just do two and a half inches and then it stays like that so you get the weekly overview monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday and it goes straight into the next week i have no idea what i'm going to use this for um a little bit of me is like you know journaling would be really easier in here than it is in the cousin i'm not going to lie i fill the cousin with a lot of uh, stickers just so my journaling space is smaller um if i did want to get rid of the a6 allergy um because, you know, if I'm going to introduce new planners into my system, I need to let go of some planners as well. So if I do want to, like, lose the ASIC strategy, this I could use. Um, I could use standard size kits in here. Uh, I'm not sure how it would look or if I'd like it, but I could. Um, yeah, I've just, I just wanted to give it a go. I wanted to give it a go. This is exactly the same as i want to give this a go but i'm so scared to write on this guys so i got out some transparent um sticky notes and stuck them on top so i can have a play around with how i want to use these uh, i don't know why i'm being so precious because i have got another one and she will bring them in stock and someone's sending me the weekly size planner to this as well so yeah i don't know why i'm being so precious but i am but i do want to try all of these planners and set them up with you guys because you know we love a setup uh have we got any blank pages in the back we've probably got a few to be fair they always give you a few uh so really one two three four and then you've got oh you've got your name and contact at the back which is quite um and this green's gorgeous i'm not going to be able to do much decoration on this apart from maybe put a cover on it maybe not 
I don't know. But yeah, that's it for this haul, guys. I have got more stuff coming in, and I'll start another haul as and when. I don't want to do like massive hauls, um, like hour, two hour long hauls, so I like to break them down for you. Um, but yeah, so I will do a video, guys, with all my planners and everything. Once everything starts coming in and I know what I'm doing, because <laughs> I have no idea, then I'll let you know. But that is the end of this haul, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give me a thumbs up. I'm missing a nail. And I will see you in my next video, guys. Bye.